Hi everyone, this is Sandy. Welcome back to Easy Cooking. So today I'm going to show you how to make another Chinese inspired dish. It is also on the healthier side, so hopefully you can give it a try. I'm going to show you how to make beef and broccoli stir fry. Remember, you'll find the list of ingredients in the description box of this video, and you will also find it in my blog where you can print the whole recipe. Let's get started. So here I have the beef. I cut it into thin strips. Now we're going to season it with a splash of sesame oil. And then we will also add in half a tablespoon of soy sauce. Then season this with half of the crushed red pepper and also add in half of the salt and half of the ground ginger. Stir so all the meat is well seasoned and then set aside. Now we're going to heat up a wok or a large skillet and then we're going to splash it with a little bit of sesame oil. And then we're going to add in the beef and we're going to cook it for about 5 minutes or until the beef is well cooked. Once the beef is well cooked, then remove it from the wok and then just set it aside. In the same wok, now we're going to add in another splash of sesame oil. And then we're going to add in the minced garlic, give it a stir. And then we're going to add in the broccoli and also add in the carrot. Then season this with the rest of the salt, with the rest of the crushed red pepper and also add in the ground ginger. Then we're going to add in half a cup of water and we're going to cook the vegetables until they are well cooked or until they have the texture and consistency that you prefer. If you want them to be kind of crunchy, cook them for about 4 minutes or if you want them to be really soft and well cooked, then cook them for about 7 minutes or so. Like I said, you can cook them until they have the texture and the consistency that you like. Once the vegetables are done, now we're going to add in the dry chile de arbol, give it a stir, and over here I have two tablespoons of cornstarch. We're going to mix the cornstarch with half a cup of beef broth, give it a stir until the cornstarch is well dissolved, and then just set it aside. Now we're going to add in the beef strips back into the wok, give it a stir, and then we're going to add in the cornstarch mixture, give it another stir, then season this with one tablespoon of soy sauce. Stir once again, then taste the flavor and add more soy sauce if you think it's necessary. I added about two tablespoons of soy sauce, but the soy sauce is to taste. You can add more or less depending on what you like. After that, we're going to add in the chopped green onion. Then garnish with sesame seeds, give it a stir. And that's about it. Once you're happy with the flavor and once the stir fry is well heated through, now you can serve it. And that's about it. Enjoy!